Hello. Or, uh, should I say, Hi, Harl. Uh, today I'm going to talk to you a little bit uh, <clears throat> about the frog here, about Kermit. Uh, now, Kermit is, uh, is, is one of... He's probably my very favorite Muppet. Why, well, thank you. And, uh, and I'm, I'm sure he's... Uh, I'm sure he's uh, at the top uh, of a lot of you guys' list as well. And, uh, and, you know, it's always good to be on top of the list. So, and, and, you know, a lot of people ask me, Did you really make that? Well, yeah, I did. Let me get in the frame a little better. <laughs> Excuse me. But yes, yes, I made, I made the frog here. Um, from scratch, all the patterns, the little fingers, the arm rods and whatnot. Uh, it took a lot of experimentation, a lot of research... You know, just just a lot of uh, a lot of trial and error, and uh, you can see I've replaced his pupils in the last week. I was using uh, s that self-adhering felt for pupils, um, but I found some self-adhering, totally flat vinyl, and uh, it looks it looks so much better. You know, it's it's totally totally flat, and uh, you know, so so I like the frog a lot. Um, that was my very first uh, attempt at a Muppet replica ever, and uh, over there is another Kermit replica that I'm working on. What? I'm being replaced? Uh, well, you're 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 kind of sort of being replaced, Kermit, but but you'll be back on YouTube. Yes, on YouTube. All right. And uh, and so I'm gonna I'm gonna go show you uh, the progress I've gotten on the new Kermit. So uh, I'm gonna I'm gonna put you down. Uh, original Kermit. All right. Uh, for how long? Well, I I don't know for how long. But I'm gonna I'm gonna put you right over there. Right over there? Yeah, right over there. All right. <clears throat> yeah, it's it's weird. I've always wanted to do this, so sometimes I do while I have the opportunity. I'll just sit down and I'll have a little, I guess, conversation with with uh, with, with Kermit. It's I don't know if that's weird or not. Who who cares? He's my you know. I built the frog, I can, I can do whatever I want with him. Anyway, this is the progress uh, on the new Kermit. Uh, you can see his head is a bit bulkier uh, up top. Uh, the collar is now made of a stiffer material. Um, it won't uh, you know, get all messed up. The neck is, uh, is broader as it should be. Uh, the mouth also has improved. Uh, very nice. Very nice work there. Um, I think the I think even the you know the stitching looks a little better on this one, um, you know there's there's the uh, the rest of his body, and so uh, and and when he's all done, I uh, he's gonna he's gonna you know be on screen. He'll have arms and and uh, and even gonna give uh, give this one legs, uh, and such. So I uh, you know, and uh, and the thing I struggle with with Kermit, I think the biggest thing I struggle with is eye ball placement. You know, because it's it's really hard. He's got an oddly shaped head, and it's, you know, it's it's hard not to get the eyes too close, you know, or too far back or too far apart this way, you know, left to right. But uh, but but I but I think this is gonna work out uh, pretty well. So you know, whatever. Uh, I'm gonna go. Uh, I'm gonna go get the other, uh, get the other Kermit. All right. There's me from the side, from the side again. You know, just all the uh, all the standard uh, Kermitisms. You know. Yes. So, that all being said, Kermit is definitely one of my favorite Muppets. You know, if if not my uh, very favorite, and he always will be. I mean, he's kind of the leader. He's kind of the head honcho, and uh, and that's. Most of the reason why I decided to build Kermit uh, as my very first, you know, kind of trial as a uh, Muppet replica. I mean, who who wouldn't want, if you've got the ability, who wouldn't want a Kermit replica? So I, I made all the patterns myself and whatnot, and uh, I really think he's coming together. Now, when I do Kermit in some of my videos, I've been doing Muppet impressions for about three years. But I never, ever wanted to do a Kermit impression. Because there are so many bad Kermit impressions out there. And here I am saying this, and I may be one of them. You tell, you tell me. But, uh, but, but I... You know, when I hear Kermit, I, I don't hear the, uh... 
I will agree with you, Frog here. You know, that, that some people try to squeeze out. I don't. I go deeper than that, and I try to hear Jim's voice through Kermit, if that makes a little more sense, you know. Uh, if, if it's Steve Whitmire performing Kermit, see, I... I think he sounds. I think Steve's uh, Kermit, you know, sounds sounds uh, sounds more up in here, you know, and he he says things a little differently and whatnot. Uh, so you know, Steve's Kermit might uh, might be up in there. Uh, but Jim's Kermit, uh, you know, Jim's Kermit was uh, was more uh, the lower register, and it had that uh, had that kind of hum uh, to the voice, you know. And it, at times, I could be commanding. I could be uh, I could be authoritative. Uh, but, you know, it, it's also very caring and relaxing, you know? So, uh, you know, I, it's, it's always been that way. Uh, ever since, uh, ever since I was a little tadpole, you know? Just, just, uh, just barely up off the floor. So, uh, you know, I'm, I'm still pretty self-conscious about the whole Kermit impression th thing, but, um, but, uh, I think the real benefit of the doubt here is the puppet. You know, when, when you see it coming out of the puppet it 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 sounds a lot better than me just trying to stand here and uh, and and talk like this you know if I got up on stage and started talking like this you'd probably have no idea who I was trying to be you know unless I told you or, or maybe you would I don't know but uh, you know and I, I think that's more how Jim sounded so uh, so you are uh, you the viewer tell me uh, the frog uh, what you think of this video what you think of the puppet puppet Sheesh. Uh, anyway, uh, tell me what you think of this puppet, uh, the other puppet over there, uh, and also what you think of the uh, the Kermit impression. You know, because I am, uh, you know, a little self-conscious about that one, uh, but that's okay. You know, a anything, uh, anything for you guys, anything to impress you guys, uh, whatever you want, you got it. All right. So I uh, will see you all next time here on uh, on Kermit 3001's channel. Or, uh, to, or, uh, <clears throat> excuse me, to, uh, <clears throat> excuse me, I have a, uh, <clears throat> frog in my throat. No? Nobody thought that was funny? Just me. Fonzie, stop writing my jokes! Shush! Ah, uh, well. Uh, but to some of my, uh, closer friends, I, you know, check this out on, uh, on my Facebook page. I, you know, so, so we're gonna get out of here finally. I'll finally get out of your hair. I uh, will see you all next time on Kermit 3001's channel! Okay, just gonna walk off. Just kinda walk off. I'd.